this can I work on fields? But not currently. Of course. Well, we lost that part of the schematics. Or Boros did. In one of his stupid labs. Or inside one of his stupid pets. It is lost. All questions lead to this conclusion. The blue fields within Berg Mountain shall be fielded with force. Forever. Alright. Fine, so, yes, get these things for us. Do not attempt to find their complicated schematics. That is for us to do. Alright, I'll go do this. Well, good. What are the token words spoken in this case? Uh, thank you? Uh, yes, thank you. Wait, is it leaving? But it's not a fine. The lobotomite will need rest, recuperation, things like that. I don't need rest. Here, my chambers, so it might be stared at. My monitor radar slowly scanning its form to collect sensitive data. That's just creepy. No, that would put it too close to us. It could press buttons, turn lights on and off, and worse, let other lobotomites in. We can give it Mobius' old room. That's where its brain got scooped out anyway. And plus, some of its parts are already there. Might be more comforting for it to hang out with its spine and heart. Home is where the heart is, after all. <laughs> See what I did there? Wet literal. I suppose. We'll have to move that couch out of there. Been putting that off too long. Eight says, let the lobotomite take the Sync Central Intelligence personality chip and reinstall it. That stuffy Mobius program Butler can walk the lobotomite, feed it, barter with it for us. It would also prevent it from going to Higgs Village and taking up residence there with my teddy bears. And it would be nice to have it so close. Your logic combined with my desire to keep the think tank lobotomite free has swayed me. Here, I present the Sync Central Intelligence. Lobotomite, take this chip to the sink. Plug it in and make sure the chip is clean or it could skip. Then make whatever crude biologic demands you need of the sink. It will cater to most of your hormonal whims. I can treat. I can treat. I can trade with the sync intelligence. Then I'll need something to activate this function, won't I? Uh, let's do this one first. I cannot dispute your logic. Do we have objects to activate the chip's exchange routines? What, like stuff? Things? Yes, things. I don't know. Might be some old Nuka Cola or Sunset Sarsaparilla bottle caps lying around. It's, it's not currency per se. Still, might be enough to trigger the thing's trade routines. Mobius put that test line for caps in the code as a debug command, I think. I don't believe that was Mobius's reason. His wild speculation concerning post-Holocaust economic systems was quite extensive and of high decibel. Enough! Surrender these so-called bottle caps, Nuka and Sunset alike. In their role as things, they will serve as adequate test subjects. All right, all right, here, cap away. Hope that stupid chip chokes on them. So I got chips. <laughs> or caps, that's cool. Uh, this chip looks like it was mass produced. Are there other ones? Are there other chips? Are you echoing what he said, or are you asking for real? He's asking, yes. <laughs> there are many other personalities. If you recall, you hurled them off the sink balcony after your argument with Mobius. Of course. It is not an argument if one is clearly right and the other is clearly wrong. I remember now. Yes, Lobotomite. There are other chips. If you want, find them. I believe they're stored on hollow tapes in many of our facilities. But you should stay out of those. No exploring and discovering things. The sink central intelligence should be enough for your <laughs> needs. So, sir. Uh... That. Yes, you may need to wiggle it in a bit, but don't 
reinforce it. We can't recode them if you break it. There is no more we can do to aid you, and our patience levels are depleted. Now go. Rest in the sink if you must, but leave us to our research. Uh, if you're done, can we move again? My biogel's starting to crampagulate. Of course! Go man your science stations! Go! I am surrounded by children. Why am I get to do this? My goodness. Uh, Let's do that. Shining armor. Toughness. Maybe. Let's go all the way at the bottom. Ooh. I like that one. Alright, let's just explore this area. First of all. to equip that, because I just want to see what it's like. Let's take some stuff now. Alright, there appears to be enough chemical components available to create a small quantity of chems, assuming one has the knowledge to do such a thing. Create some stim packs. actually. Dr. Dalla. Ah, uh, yeah, you're a bit on the weird side. Which one's this one? Dr. Eight, the one that can't talk. Boris. Let's steal it. Oh man, look how easy that was. Alright, let's just head up here. Take some more stuff. Nope. So much stuff to take. Look at all these mentats. Dr. Mobius' glasses, that's worth a lot. What is this thing? Apparently nothing. Or a trophy. I have to get a good look at this. I can't really get out a sniper rifle, I forgot. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so confused. So used to Skyrim. Controls. I want that, I wanted that. And I want that. Oh, I did 
would want that actually. I'm sure this is very interesting to watch me loot all this stuff. Not have anything to say while I'm doing it. Have you done all we asked? No. Shouldn't there be uh, some subtitles there? Yeah, turn those on. If not, we will not hesitate to ask again. <laughs> <laughs> These are great characters. Whoa, this is a really creepy room. This must be Dala's room. She has an obsession with humans. Worth anything? Let's uh, get out of here then. We've seen everything. Sonic Emitter Revelation now available in the vendor interface. Salutations and felicitations, sir, and a most jocund welcome to the sink. I am your electronic valet and household central processor. May I be of service, sir? Uh, are you some kind of artificial intelligence? All modules in this habitat are synthetic personalities atop a mundane operating system. There is no intelligence here, sir. Indeed, sir. Though if sir's aim is to activate them, I lament to inform sir that most have been offline for ten years. Although I say sir all the time, every five words. However, if sir is determined to inflict upon sir's self their dubious services, sir might locate backup personality disks elsewhere in the facility. So I can access it without loading them? Tragically, the core operating systems are also located on the personality tapes, sir. Of course. If the tape is installed, sir may request I switch their dialectic interfaces off and will oblige to delectation. However, sir will still be required to locate and install a backup holotape to access their functionality. Why are there so many? As I am given to understand, sir, this facility was once the property of a Dr. Mobius. He crafted the personality modules as part of a collection of experiments on the subject of machine-human interface. As to the reason for the unusual choices of devices to receive the modules, I cannot say.